For six weeks, Lucy Langenberg wasn't just a rising senior at Fayetteville Manlius High School, she was a research assistant in Professor Charles Driscoll's environmental engineering lab, using advanced equipment to analyze mercury levels in biological samples collected from Adirondack lakes. I feel like this is what it's really like to be working, I mean I'm working with people who are doing real research in a laboratory and I'm going to be doing some of that on my own. This summer, Lucy and eight other Syracuse area high school students are working with College of Engineering and Computer Science professors as research interns. Miles Sherbent from Nottingham High School in Syracuse has been programming data extraction tools and studying privacy on social network sites. He says the opportunity has made him even more confident about studying computer science when he goes to college. Before, I had no coding experience, and this is pretty much all coding, so it's get, so the exposure is good. Professor Reza Zafarani says Miles and fellow intern Somil Agaral from Jamesville DeWitt High School quickly showed they were ready for advanced research concepts. They've done excellent things, uh, things that are usually not even at the level of undergrad in the first one or two years. But they're going so fast that we have updated the program a couple of times. So basically, I think by the time they end this, they have done some research that grad students usually do. Haley Morgan from Jamesville DeWitt High School knows she wants to study engineering in college, possibly chemical engineering. This summer, she will present her research on chemical reactions involving different metals based on her work in Professor Jesse Bond's lab. I really like getting to be able to design my own experiments and be able to kind of create new ideas. To come here and to really see what you're doing to realize, okay, I actually really do like this and really want to do this later in life. The summer research internship program for high school students was created thanks to a gift from Syracuse University alumni Tom and Linda McCausland. In addition to lab work and presenting their research, interns also had the opportunity to tour the Carrier Dome and get a behind-the-scenes look at the engineering skill required to keep the air-supported roof inflated. Lucy Langenberg believes the internship has prepared her to step into a higher education research environment, no matter which program she decides to major in. I mean, I feel like, you know, the people here are making a difference in science. You know, I'm getting experience I wouldn't get elsewhere. Because I, I thought about going into engineering and researching, and it's really cool to just kind of get a glimpse of that.